गाइस वेलकम बैक टू येट अनदर इंटरेस्टिंग वीडियो बेस्ड ऑन क्लाउड कंप्यूटिंग सो इन टुडेस वीडियो आई विल बी डिस्कसिंग रिगार्डिंग द वेरियस ऑपरेशन मोड्स व्हिच आर देयर इन द ओपन स्टैक आर्किटेक्चर ऑफ क्लाउड कंप्यूटिंग सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सो देयर आर बेसिकली टू डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ ऑपरेशन मोड्स व्हिच हैपेंस इन द ओपन स्टैक दैट इज यू हैव द सिंगल होस्ट मोड एंड देन यू हैव द मल्टी होस्ट मोड सो लेट्स हैव अ लुक ऑन दिस व्हाट दीस टू मोड्स बेसिकली आर so uh, first in single host mode you have the network service that is based on the cluster controller that is the clc so in this you will be having one single particular clc cluster controller and then you will be having all the network services included in that and then the clc receives traffic from all the compute nodes that is the cc and then the clc forwards this traffic to the internet and then this acts as an internet gateway and then you can uh do the particular kind of activity for your public as well as other kind of clouds now uh, the requirement is the floating ips and the security groups are being hosted in one particular repository or one particular center that is the clc that is the cluster controller so a uh, diagrammatic representation has been given like you have the clc at the center then you have the multiple number of compute nodes that is uh, around it and then each individually will submit that particular kind of traffic to the clc which it gets and then finally if uh, everything if all of the compute nodes have finished their work then it's being forwarded to the internet for its hosting now uh, this architecture or this kind of operation mode has got one particular kind of limitation uh, like you have single point of failure like you have uh, the cluster controller which is like uh, collecting all the services from all the compute nodes and so if like a consequence of like uh, collapsing happens in this kind of cluster controller and uh, if some way or it goes down then the entire network or this operation mode goes into waste and so single point of failure is the uh, major kind of concern in this kind of operating mode that is unavailability of the cluster controller will stop the instances communicating on the network it's obvious that if this goes down then uh, nobody of this uh, cc can just control or submit the traffic to the parent kind of thing so this kind of uh, mode just goes down if there is a single point of failure in order to overcome this kind of uh, limitation you have the multi host mode that is in this you have the copy of the network that is service so network uh, where here i mention it's a kind of particular configuration that is there that you can replicate across all the nodes which are available in that particular uh system so a copy of this network is run on each of the compute nodes and these nodes are used as the internet gateway so here it was like uh you have one particular cluster controller and then uh, to each of the cluster controller you just submit the traffic which is given by the uh, computes so it's consumed by the instances that are running on these individual nodes and so uh, this traffic that is being used it's like given to or forwarded to the instances that are running these individual nodes then here also floating ips and security groups are also hosted on this compute nodes for each instances whereas in this you have the floating ips and security groups only for the cluster controller here in this you need to have the floating ips as well as the security groups for each of the compute nodes and so one major limitation of this is like it requires nodes to have public ip addresses for communicating on the internet if not available then the it's unable to operation in that particular mode so it's like uh, you need to acquire floating ips and security ips uh, separately for each of the compute nodes and so that's kind of pretty difficult task to go with this so well that was all about the operation uh, modes of open star architecture so hope you guys enjoyed this video found you got educated by watching this video please do like share comment and most importantly don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you very much